So, it, what is today's date, anyways? Let's see what today's date is. All right, it's October 30th. All right, cool. So, we're, we're rolling up on November. It's, uh, we only got a little bit of time left in the year. So, two months. Now, a lot of us had New Year's resolutions, you know, things we want to accomplish, things we want to do. Uh, a lot of people said they're going to get in shape this year. They're going to be more consistent in the gym. You know, they just wanted to make things happen. Maybe start a business. You know, the the year's not over. Um, and I think it's you know it, it's kind of that crunch time. Now when we're looking at twenty twenty five, it's already around the corner. If you haven't made it happen this year. You know, sit down, write out a plan, and then commit to executing on that plan starting today. <clears throat> so this is something that served me pretty well, and I, I know it served a lot of other people very, very well, is that when you make a decision that you want to do something, and then we'll put it off until like, oh, I'm going to start on the first of the month. And then you go for that last hurrah, you get smashed, you have a good time, you, and then you feel like shit by the time it's to the time that by the time it's time for you to actually start doing what you said you were going to do. So even if you don't know exactly where to start, just start by taking perfect action. Like not everything has to be perfect. You don't have to have everything lined up. You can figure it out on the way. You don't have to have it all figured out when you start. That being said, you know, I'm going to think, no, nah, I don't think, you know, we're going to take the month off of November uh, from alcohol. And, you know, doing that does a couple different things. So I have some stuff that I want to accomplish. Um, I want to put some new stores up. I want to edit more videos. And... You know, for me to do all that, I need to make sure that I have a clarity of mind, you know, focused, and being able to make sure that I'm just firing on all cylinders. And it's always funny because, like, when I'm thinking about doing this stuff, you know, <laughs> my wife will hit me up. She's like, yeah, I think I want to take a November off from alcohol. I'm like, all right. She's like, well, except for the holidays. I'm like, all right, whatever. I think I'm just going to go sober. She's like, oh, okay, I'll do it too. Um, and, you know, just simple things like that allow us to win so i guess uh, uh thinking about that well i'll put a little list together so i want to finish my kitchen um get all the painting done all the drywall done all the leaden table done um here in the next couple of weeks and at least get to the point where we're picked out the cabinets and hopefully get those in there before december so it's 30 days okay cool um i want to put up at least one drop shipping store probably two um here in the next week and i want to edit at least we'll say three videos a week and so you know doing all of that on that schedule and now i have the receipt because i did this on camera um and i'm going to share it you know that's gonna that there's absolutely no time no time for me to waste time um turning off my mental capacity my cognitive ability and subconscious mind to be able to keep all of those things rolling and juggling at the same time and so uh, if you guys are all in for november uh, i want you to comment below i want to see some people take control of their life before the end of the year and, you know, it's not going to be the new year, new me, when everybody else is saying that same bullshit. Come January 1st, you are to be two months ahead. So I challenge you. Join us. Let's change some lives. Talk to you later. Get after it.